All right, well, welcome back, everybody, to Enter the Gungeon. Last time, we did terrible. So this time, we're going to be the convict. Uh, I uh, beat the game. Not beat the game, sorry. Bleh. Beat the first boss. Um, one of the first bosses as the convict last night. So, should be able to do okay. I just... Okay, a lot of noise there. Sorry about that. I was trying to adjust both my headphones and my chair, and it just went bad. So I apologize for that. Alright, so this time I hope to... Well, okay, that, that worked out. Not for them. Okay, so I learned something about using this shotgun. And I'm, I'm gonna... Oh, I forgot. I forgot. I'm stupid. I forgot I'm stupid. No, I'm kidding. I never forget that. What I, what I learned about this shotgun is that you gotta get in there with it. You can't, you can't just get a, be afraid of it. Also... The, the slot off shotgun, this is her primary. Alright, this is her primary weapon. Oh, this is horrifying. What did we get? Shock rounds. Oh, I think we know what those do. Alright, but we're going to read it just in case. <clears throat> uh, electrify. Passive. Links bullets together with chain lightning. I've seen this. I saw this on the first video I watched on this. Uh, the signature weapon of Alistair, the Thunderbolt. Upon his second descent into the gungeon, the Thunderbolt famously remarked, Lightning won't strike here again. He wasn't wrong. Oh, that means he died. Oh, he died. Ugh, that's no good. Yeah, you see that, though? See what that does? Isn't that cool? Yes, it is. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is cool. I don't need your approval of what I think is cool. Does have to kind of hit them though. Unfortunately, it's not uh, crazy damaging, so it doesn't really matter. Unfortunately, we took the oh yeah, we did take damage. I remember that's how we got our our, our damage boost. Hello, hello. I don't know what to do in this room. I've tried things. By that, I mean I've clicked E on the painting and nothing happened. So I'm just gonna leave. I bet there's a bomb enemy. If I had to guess. So you're telling me that there's a bomb in him? I've had the uh, I've had the AK as well. It's okay. It uh, I used it to defeat my enemies. That would have worked. I just want to remind everyone that that could have worked. Didn't, but it could have. Um, hmm. So I don't know what to do. About I need I want another weapon because this is not in my opinion. This is not a uh, a beat a boss weapon. This is a Clear a room pretty easily weapon, you know, but this is not uh, I'm gonna win the game weapon And that's really what I care about getting here You know because I've I've cleared rooms. I've cleared hundreds. Maybe No, I've maybe cleared a hundred rooms I also realize I've, I've, there's no way I've cleared hundreds. You know, I've cleared maybe a hundred rooms. And the uh, literal amount of time I've played this game, I have died many times. But uh, I'm here. I'm here to, you know, kill bosses and chew bubblegum. And I'm all out of gum. That's, a, that's an Evil Dead reference. If you guys uh, didn't know. Didn't know that. Which is possible. If you're around my age, it's probably unlikely you would have done it unless you watched it with your dad when you were way too young to probably watch a movie like that. Not complaining. I enjoyed it. I enjoyed Evil Dead. I think that one's Army of Darkness. It could be Evil Dead 2, though. I've not actually seen Evil Dead 2, so it may not even be a reference I should understand. Uh, this is working out, too, though. Her sidearm's not bad. You know, it's not bad because of the lightning. It's not a good weapon. Don't be fooled. Alright, think we got us a chest. Maybe a shop. Chest. Alright, that's good. Squirt gun. What's it do? Mega Dowser. Contents under pressure. Hold on. Forgot about reading. I, you know, I've not actually read any of these. But, uh, anyways, uh, Mega Dowser. Content under pressure. Beam. 
Okay, a water gun might seem to be a poor weapon for gungeoneering, and in most cases that is true, but a well-placed blast of water can douse a raging inferno. A soaked, a soaked enemy can be electrified. Oh, wow. We're gonna, we're gonna do really well. Uh, a dazed foe can be pushed into the abyss, and the gungeon created, um, like creativity is key to victory. Okay, I hope it automatically works with our, um, oh, we'll just go down, I pressed A, um, I hope it automatically just works with our, um, electric bullets, it may not, so we may have to, like, spray and then shoot, let's see, yeah, we'll have to spray and then shoot, not a problem, though, doesn't do a damn thing, as it turns out, this doesn't seem to have done any more damage at all all right I was not too concerned about killing them all there moonshine double vision I don't know if I want something called double vision how much are you 25 25 yeah I know this isn't fun this is not a fun thing to choose to do, but you guys know that I am bad at this game. And you want to see a boss defeated. And I think it's going to happen this time for the first time. What is the blue line? Oh, Gatling Ball. This should be doable. This should be doable. Sorry if you guys could hear me drinking water and it didn't sound well. I hate how long it takes, though, to get through that animation. Come and get it, friend. I'm not your friend. I'm your enemy. You can be my friend and my enemy. Where you at? So, here's the thing, guys. I'm uh, having second thoughts. Oh, I didn't... You know what? I actually didn't even look at his health. I'm no longer having second thoughts here. I feel very confident, in fact, in our ability to defeat him. I got hit again. I would be dead... If I did not buy those things, I just want you guys to realize this. And also realize I may still die here. But we may not because he's choosing to do this attack now. But we've got to actually shoot him to kill him. Or so I've been told! Oh, don't let it end. There it goes. Awesome. Okay, congratulations me. I beat a boss for the first time on stream. This isn't a stream. Shush. You guys get out of there. Come on. <laughs> Brutal. Alright. And armor. Yeah, you get both. Mega Hand. Bet we know what it does, but let's read it. Okay, let's see. <clears throat> P, right, because of the that's what the logo. Yeah. Okay. Charge. Uh, Mega Hand is a relic of the Ten Days War against the robots. The most powerful robot masters would modify it for their own styles of combat. This one is basic, but still works well. But still works well. I don't know why I said it like that. Oh, it's even it even got the the sort of power modules so floor 2 is crazy hard and I'm bad at it because I really don't know what most of the enemies do because I've only been to floor 2 this will be my third time fourth time maybe um, <clears throat> and if you guys don't like the idea that I have uh, played this game on my own time then I will change that I'm sorry I didn't even, I actually didn't, I, I didn't expect people to get upset, but if, if it does upset you and you promise that you're going to be watching the series, then I will most certainly change that. I won't, uh, that was bad. I meant to press one button, but obviously did not press it. 
Oh, this charge is super fast. I also need to kind of watch that. Boy, that was dumb. <clears throat> Didn't even notice. Didn't even pay attention to what I was walking into. Just sort of walked. There it went. Good, 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 good. Oh, guys, that was... That was great. Oh, my gosh. Gonna do another one. Uh, let's do the hunter. All right? Damn. It'll, it'll eventually get to a point where I'm not dying. Um, at least on the first floor. But if I die on floor two like early then I will uh, probably still do a second run no matter what and if I die on floor one it's always going to be at least a two person run I could could end up being a three it'll never probably be more than three people hopefully it'll never be more than two but that could happen but okay so I've learned um, some things as well about her you really do kind of want to use her primary weapon. Or not her primary. So you kind of want to use the, the... The crossbow. Just the damage that you, you get is kind of like... It's not negligible. You know, you, you need to... You need, you need to kill enemies. But now against this, I would say we're fine using this. I do love that reload animation. I don't know if you guys have noticed, but if you look in the corner where my gun is, uh, well, where my uh, gun icon is. Damn it. Why can't corgis fight? Are they not, are they not you know, bred to? It's almost like it's uh, a handicapped dog. The same, the same traits that make it marketable also make it an inferior inferior animal to other dogs now, I wasn't implying to humans that was sort of a given oh oh you 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 bastards I hate all of you but I'm glad you go down in one hit oh no oh no You bastard. I hate you. I hate you. I don't want to die like this. And this is going to end up probably being a three run. I need to learn a little confidence. You know, it goes a long way. If you say, I will not die here, then you may not. But you also may. Got a kill. Got another one, apparently. Yeah. Take that. I like flipping tables on my way out. It doesn't matter, but I like doing it. Also, sometimes like flipping them on my way in. That actually does stuff. Hello. Come on. Gotta be a little careful. You know, I'm gonna lose some stuff. So, Corgi friend, you wanna go ahead and be loosing some of uh, your famous uh, hearts from the ground? That'd be great. Missed that by like, what, an inch, if that? That was bad. Okay. Ah. Uh. All right. All 
right, we've got a little bit of money. Let's see if we can't go in and buy some stuff. Ha ha! Okay. What is this? Snowballer. I hate that item. Map might be helpful. Don't really care if I get the map, though, to be perfectly honest with you. I mean, it's okay, but, like, I, I don't, you know. You should explore the whole map anyways, so it, it doesn't really matter. Like, you could wind up in, like, a dire... Thank you! Unless you didn't do that. You could wind up in a dire situation, like, where you need a shop really, really badly. But, it's just not a big deal. Oh, uh, if that bench wasn't there, it probably wouldn't have killed either of you guys anyway, so it doesn't matter. All we did was waste furniture. Uh, really would like a chest at this point, just saying. Negatives of, um... Actually, it's not really a negative. I was about to say, a negative of using the crossbow, though, is that you get hit on tables and such, but so does everything else. Oh, this was good. Uh, what is this? Alien sidearm shield breaker. That might be okay. Let's see. I definitely like the look. It looks a lot like uh, the plasma rifle from Halo. Um, yeah, charged. All right. The uh, hegemony, 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 hegem I don't know, uh, of man has fought and won three major wars with alien races. Hundreds of these pistols were salvaged after a second of these wars. After the second of these wars. It's got a lot of... Uh, it says it's a charged weapon. I hate the idea of having to pay money to use it, but it's okay. That was a joke. You don't have Okay. Okay. Whatever. It's probably a boss fight. It was indeed. Huh. I hope this is a really good weapon. Oh. Good or not, it sounds awesome. Oh, it's kind of cool. It's kind of cool. All right. Oh, no, I've not had this one. I had something else. Cartographer's ring. Oh, we did have that. Yeah, yeah, we did have that. Some floors are familiar. Okay. Okay. Uh, well, that's everything, so we should be okay. I don't know who I want to fight here. Maybe the twins. I don't think I've shown you guys the twins yet. Maybe, maybe not. If not, here they are. If so, here they are again. Bullet twins. Trigger twins. Whatever. Yeah, I always assume alliteration. They're not, um, they're, they're not easy, but they're not hard. Okay, that was, uh, has nothing to do with how easy or hard they may be, because I just made a, a fool's move. Now, you can, you don't have to, you have to kill them both. I was going to say you don't have to kill them both, but that's not uh, accurate. In fact, it's, it's the opposite, what is the opposite of that, uh, of accurate, uh, not accurate, unaccurate, I think. Uh, but, um... When, once you kill one twin, the other one becomes uh, aggroed, super aggroed, which is not bad. In fact, it really makes them a little easier to deal with because they're not hard. All right. This is not, this is like the opposite of the um, Ornstein and Smo fight from Dark Souls. It's optical because Dark Souls 3 is coming out. Uh, some people already have it. But uh, it's the opposite in the sense that. You can, um, once you kill one, the fight gets easier, whereas I would, it's, that's sort of the case in, that's sort of not the case, I should say, in, um, Dark Souls. Oh, okay, um, uh, as soon, like, I'm not kidding, that was probably by, like, a tenth of a second difference. I pressed the Q button, which is the, which is the blinders or whatever. That was unfortunate, very, very unfortunate, um... But I'm probably, let's see, am I going to call it here? Yeah, I'm going to call it here. All right, well, uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you next time.